everyone, it's Amy. Today I'm going to be showing you the swatches of Light Elegance under the Big Top collection. So this is their Fall 2018 collection. I saw them post it online and I had to have them. So I went ahead and opened the box up. It also came with six swatch sticks so that way you can swatch the colors right on them. And it did come with the labels already made. You just have to stick them right on. So that's very handy. And so these only come with the collections. If you buy them individually, you do not get the swatch sticks. Go ahead and start with gesture. I did already remove all of the seals off camera. But this one, it looks like it's going to be a berry color. And so compared to the packaging, the packaging looks a little bit more pink. And this looks a little bit more on the red side. And so there is the one coat of gesture. On camera it's still looking a little bit more on the pink side. Um, it is like a pinky red, but in person it does look a little bit more red. And this next one here is Bearded Lady. So this one looks like it's going to be a nice medium brown, like a chocolate brown color. And that pretty much looks just like the packaging. So let's go ahead and do the swatch. So here is what that one looks like. Again, just a nice chocolate brown. And these are just one coats I am doing, so they are very pigmented. This next one is Ringmaster. So this one looks like a deep olive type of green. And actually looks more of a gray green in the bottle. And here is Ringmaster, again like a nice dark gray green. Next one is Come One Come All, so this one's going to be a purpley gray color. It's definitely more gray in the bottle, but it does have that hint of purple to it. So here is Come One, Come All. This next one is Main Attraction, and this has more of a metallic lid compared to just the uh, matte lid. And so this one's going to have some sort of shimmer to it then. Oh wow. <laughs> this one might be my favorite. I love purple. And it's so shimmery. Ooh, this one looks so pretty. Oh, I'm so excited. So excited. Oh, but that color is gorgeous. Oh, I can I think. Um, this one, Main Attraction, would go really well with the Come One, Come All. You could definitely do some sort of berry nails with it. So pretty. The last one from the Color Gel collection is It's Showtime. And this one again has metallic lid. This one has a holographic hue to it. The color is not holographic, so a little misleading, but it's pretty packaging. 
but this really pretty champagne color. And this one's super sparkly as well. So there's what showtime, or it's showtime looks like. A nice, super shimmery, sparkly champagne color. This would be fun to put some chunky glitters in as well. So here are all the colors from the fall color gel collection. These colors are beautiful, gorgeous, perfect for fall. So excited. Like, so, so, so excited. I almost just knocked something over. I was so excited. But let's get into the color gels now. All right, so here are the glitter gels. So let's get into them. So we'll start off with a fire breather. And so this one has a holographic tint to the top. Oh, this one's so pretty. And this one, dare I say, is a holographic red. Reds are very hard to pick up on the holographic hue to it, but I feel like it is. It's hard to tell with the reds and the holographic. All I did was remove the little seal on them. Oh, it looks pink now. And these glitters, I might have to do two coats on them. We'll see. I guess it just depends how concentrated the glitter is. But it is pretty concentrated already, but it does have that pink undertone to it. So it probably just depends on what you pair it with. If you put this on top of a red, it's definitely going to pull more of that fiery red and orange. But if you put this on top of a pink or a purple or a pinky red then it's, it might pull more of those pink tones that one's super pretty and the glitter is pretty concentrated in that one as well so the next one is lion tamer this one again has that holographic hue to it ooh but that's pretty it's like a brown sparkle I was going to say copper, but it's not quite copper. It is more on the brown side, but it has that gold, coppery undertone to it. Oh, so, so pretty. Oh, I love this one. It's so unique because it is a brown glitter. You don't see too many brown glitters. So this next one is Smoke and Mirrors. Wow. So it is a silver glitter, but it does almost have a smokiness to it. And it's super reflective, like a mirror. So that's pretty neat. I'm interested to see how concentrated this one is. Oh yeah, it's super concentrated. Oh yeah, that's a one coat or full coverage. But so pretty. The camera almost has a hard time focusing on it because it's so reflective. This next one is Daredevil. And this one is a super unique glitter, so it almost has like flaky chunks in it. And it has, it's mostly like a gold champagne, but it also has like a burnt orange, dark copper kind of color to it. Ooh, I want this one. It's going to be interesting to, to swatch it. It's definitely more on the sparse side, but...
but that's okay because I think the sparseness of it gives it that look of the shards in it. But you could definitely build it up to be more solid. Uh, but that one's very unique. So the next one is Snake Charmer. Ooh, ooh this is pretty. So it's like a green reflective, but also has a teal reflective, but super dark. Like the base almost looks black. I won't be able to tell until I swatch it. Oh yeah, now that I'm pulling it out, it definitely looks like it has a black base. Oh yeah, this one's interesting. It does have that black glitter because once you, if you spread it out thin, you can see that it does have the black glitters in it. So it's a black glitter with green and teal as well. Ooh, that's pretty. Oh, I love that one. The final one we're going to swatch is Clowning Around. Ooh, so this one's more of that pink. So, going along with Gesture, how it has that pink tint to it, but it's kind of a red as well. If we put this on top of Gesture, then it is going to pull more of that red out versus if we put more of a red glitter on this then it's going to pour more of the red out of gesture but this one is definitely more of a pink pink berry color and this one does look like it's going to be more on the sparse side but let's see and it's quite chunky yeah it's definitely more on the sparse side but again you can always build up a glitter So there is that one. That one is probably the sparsest glitter, but it's pretty and it's different than all of the others. All of these glitters have been very unique and very different. So here are all of the glitter gels from the 2018 fall collection. As you can see, they are all very unique glitters, very different. You're going to get so many uses out of these. Light Elegance, you've outdone yourself with this collection. I'm in love. So here are all of the colors all together. We have the color gels and then we have the glitter gels. So let me show you some that I would pair together that would work very nicely. So Gesture and Fire Breather is going to be a super pretty combination here. But you can also pair Gesture with Clowning Around. And that gives it a completely different look. This gives it more of a berry look. This one almost looks more wintry to me. But if you pair it with Fire Breather, different, completely different look, which is awesome. And here you can take Lion Tamer and Bearded Lady. This one's going to be a pretty combination. And again, very unique. You don't see too many brown sets, so this one is going to be super fun to bring out for this fall. But I would also take Bearded Lady with a Daredevil, I think. That one's going to be a super fun, super unique combination as well. I would say you can take Smoke and Mirrors paired with any of these would be super pretty. I probably would not pair it with It's Showtime because that's too much of like a champagne against a silver. Probably wouldn't do that. But against any of the other colors it would be super pretty as an accent nail. And Snake Charmer I would say it would be really pretty with Come One Come All. 
add a pop to the gray tone. But I think it's supposed to be paired with Ringmaster. Of course, you can do whatever you want. But paired with Ringmaster gives it a different look to it. So there's lots of options for mixing and matching. Um, I would even take Daredevil paired with its Showtime and layer these. That would be super pretty. But there's so many different combinations to do with just these. And if you pair any of these with the other fall colors you have in your collection, I mean, it just tops everything off. So you guys, definitely go check out Light Elegance. Keep an eye on what they're doing. There will be a winter collection that they will be releasing later this year. Definitely keep an eye out for this. I have to say this is a must-have for the fall. You guys need these collections. I'm so excited. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye!